We find the defendant, Hannah Gutierrez, guilty of involuntary manslaughter as charged in count one. Hannah Gutierrez showed little emotion as the jury found her guilty of involuntary manslaughter in the death of cinematographer Helena Hutchins. Is this your uh, verdict? Yes. Ma'am, is this your verdict? Yes. Hutchins was killed and the film's director injured while Alec Baldwin was practicing a cross draw on the movie set. Gutierrez, as the movie's armorer, loaded Baldwin's gun and mistakenly put a live round into his revolver. Defense attorney Jason Bowles argued the jury should acquit his client because it was Alec Baldwin, not Gutierrez, who shot and killed Hutchins. It was not in the script for Mr. Baldwin to point the weapon. Ms. Gutierrez Reed, nor anybody else, knew that Mr. Baldwin in that moment was going to point the weapon right at Helena and Ms. Hutchins and Mr. Souza and do what he did. Special Prosecutor Carrie Morrissey agreed that Baldwin shares in the blame for Hutchins' death, but it was the job of the armorer to ensure all firearms on the set were safe. When she took this job, she agreed to that responsibility. There is no exception in the law for your young. The exception in the law does not exist. The law treats everyone the same, and it must. Got a little bite to him. <laughs> Prosecutors played behind the scenes footage from Rust. It is evidence, they say, of how Gutierrez failed to follow safety protocols, letting actors point and play with weapons when they were not filming. Here, cameras caught a live round in Baldwin's gun belt, one of six found on the movie set of Rust. This case is about constant, never-ending safety failures that resulted in the death of a human being and nearly killed another. That convinced jurors of Gutierrez's guilt, and they returned their verdict in less than three hours. Pretty much not checking the weapons, just handing them over and like, here, and not checking. I mean, that was, that was a big deal. I mean, you can't do that. And if you have live rounds there, and you don't even know it, and you're not checking them. Gutierrez faces up to 18 months in jail when she is sentenced. Her attorney vows to appeal while Alec Baldwin faces a trial in July.